Hey everyone, it's Tira with Rent Mason Bees, and yes, I'm standing underneath an umbrella in the pouring rain. It's been raining for two days straight. I came out to check on my little bees to see what they're up to, and of course there's no bee activity because it's so wet and it's so cold. So they are gonna crawl into those holes and find shelter. They are gonna go out into your habitat and find shelter, and they are able to self-generate their own heat. So they're going to be okay if it's raining and it's cold outside. As soon as the rain stops, they'll start coming out again. If it's sunny, you'll really see a lot more bee activity if they're stuck around in your neighborhood. Again, I keep answering this question. If you haven't seen bees in a while, watch the video. I'll link it down below, but I just did a video on how to check your cocoon to make sure all your bees have emerged and if they have that just means they're out in your habitat laying babies um, and if they have not emerged just give them some more time to do their thing and go and pollinate but I wanted to show you where my little bees are um, not hibernating they are um, just taking shelter in my bee block so I'll flip the camera around and I'll show you some cute little bee bums that I see poking out of my big block I have a large block out here I released 2,000 bees on my property so there's it's a big block um, but anyways I thought I'd give you I thought I'd show you all right hold on all right so this is my large uh, bee house that uh, we have out here on our property I have about 2,000 bees that I released out here. So this is the size that we use. But when it's sunny, there are so many bees buzzing around. But right now it's pouring down rain and I can see a lot of bee bums in these little holes. You see a shimmery green, that's a little bee bum. Bee bum. Oh, and who is that? Well, hello, little bee. Come say hi. There's a little bee sheltering in there. So you can look through your block and see they'll crawl in and they can self-generate their own heat and keep themselves warm. Sometimes they'll go deeper into the holes if they want to stay even warmer. You can see this one kind of fluttering its, its mouth, its mandibles. Um, this is how they generate their heat. They just move their bodies to keep themselves warm. There's another one doing the same thing. Let's see if I can get that one. Where did he go on the camera? It's hard to tell off this thing. Um, but anyways, I just wanna show you what your little bees might be doing. They're gonna find shelter in your bee house. They're gonna find shelter in your yard, under your roof deck awnings, or wherever you might have shelter for these little bees. And they'll be okay. They'll come back out once the sun comes out again and it warms everything up. And they'll be back buzzing around, pollinating your yard. But you can see I have quite a few bees sheltering in the block right now. So if you want to take a look at your block, you can take a flashlight and go out and look. You can see some shimmery bums in there or just some heads poking out saying hello. So give us a call if you have any questions. Check out our YouTube channel where I post a ton of videos and uh, send me an email if you have any questions. Info at rentmasonbees.com. Happy pollinating.